This horrifying clip was recorded in China a few days back in early October of 2024. It's since been labeled as an extremely disturbing video. However, the context I found for it makes it even more chilling. What you saw was the moment a man swerved and ended up in the river while driving his car. The crazy part is that he got trapped in it as the water started flowing. This was all while he was on the phone with his daughter and he could be heard crying for help. Now I did some extra digging and there's hope that this video isn't what it seems like. The window was down and then after the video cut, it was suddenly up. The Chinese sources also hint that this could be a reenactment, but I don't think we'll ever know. Let's hope for the best, considering this footage was recovered from the car. This footage was captured near Goma in the Democratic Republic of Congo on the 3rd of October 2024. A ferry called the MV Murdi was carrying roughly 278 passengers. This would seem pretty ordinary. The only issue was that the ferry was only built to carry 80. It seems the overcrowded ferry couldn't hold on and sank close to Goma after crossing the lake from Menorca. It was recorded by the people at the pier, so you can see how close they got to making it. Unfortunately, it just couldn't do it, and as a result, at least 78 people have tragically passed away at the time of making this video. Government sources also say that this figure is almost certain to rise, which is just horrific. This dashcam footage was captured by a car parked in Venezia on the 14th of July 2022. The place it's parked at is called Vinicenko Street and it's only a small distance away from the Victory Square where a former officer's house is located. Keep all of this in mind while watching this clip. This dashcam somehow captured the moment two caliber cruise missiles arrived at the square, targeting the former officer's house. I've got no idea who that guy is or what he did to deserve two cruise missiles, but clearly this was a big strike. It resulted in 27 civilians tragically passing away as this was one of the most crowded squares in the entire city. The following video was recorded in a completely different continent to the previous one. It was recorded in Saudi Arabia and made its way to many social media platforms. Now the reason for that is pretty clear and will leave you shocked, but it's important to note that these people had no idea they would capture something like this. <laughs>
have no clue if this is road rage or something else, but there's absolutely no way that truck driver didn't notice the white SUV he was dragging along. In the previous video, I'd included something similar, but that truck was noticeably bigger and the car noticeably smaller. However, it's the opposite here. The cab and the truck can easily see the roof of the white SUV, so this is 100% intentional. Thankfully, it didn't result in anything worse, but the amount of horrific outcomes for this situation is no joke. You guys will probably already know this, but Mount Everest isn't actually regarded as the most dangerous mountain to climb. You'd be surprised to know that there are at least five more mountains that are deadlier, and one of them has become quite infamous. This clip was captured on that mountain, located on the Pakistan-China border, that goes by the name of K2. This video was posted by some climbers who were summiting K2 when they noticed something falling. The camera angle is a bit confusing and you might chalk it off as some inanimate object. But there's a very real possibility of this being a person. Either that or it's a person in a sleeping bag. Regardless, no matter how much I zoomed and upscaled the quality, I still couldn't tell, so all we can do is hope for the best in this instance. K2 had a mortality rate of 25% in 2021, meaning one in every four climbers perished on the mountain. This is one of the worst videos you will see today, and I'm not joking, the camera work is genuinely horrendous, but there's a valid reason for that. A reason that makes this clip absolutely terrifying. It was captured by the crew of a British oil tanker near the Bab al-Mandab Strait off the coast of Yemen. This area has been getting a lot less attention lately, but the crazy videos still continue to come out. What you saw was the moment an unmanned kamikaze boat filled with explosives went straight into the oil tanker, resulting in a massive explosion. The maritime security on board the vessel failed to protect it, and viewers who saw the video questioned why they were hired in the first place. The following video also originates from Brazil, being captured by some people on a small boat. I say that, but they're in the water and not in the boat, and there's a pretty good reason for this. The water will keep them safe from what's on the surface. <laughs> I don't have a single clue how this happened, and I've never seen anything like this. While they were fishing, bothering no one, their engine got swarmed by bees or wasps. I don't know what they are exactly, but clearly the queen must have gone inside the engine, which is why they've swarmed it. To save themselves, the fishermen are in the water, which has to be the most bizarre sequence of events I've seen today. I would not want to get stung by so many of them.